uh, day five of Vlogmas. Um, just getting ready for work right now. Um, this week will hopefully not be as crazy as it was last week, so that would be ideal. Today I'm wearing, it's sort of a handmade, not really, it was a resurrected thrift store find. Again, I do that a lot. Um, I buy things at thrift stores that are either too big or just for the fabric and then reuse it for the fabric. So that's what this was. This was already a long pair of um, overalls or dungarees or a pinafore dress as you um, European people like to say. So if you want to make one yourself, the Clio uh, design by the Tilly and the Buttons designer, um, her patterns are awesome. I've used her Agnes top. You can make a pinafore dress as well. And this one's just kind of like a red corduroy perfect for Christmas season. So yeah, time to get ready and head into work and get some coffee. Okay, so I changed my mind. I'm wearing something else, but I decided to still leave the rest of that in there. So you could have that information about the Clio dress from Tilly and the Buttons. Um, question for all of you guys. I've been using this Kiehl's lip balm. It's not gonna focus, it's too bright. Mika, what are you doing? Can you stop that? Thank you. Using this Kiehl's lip balm, it's pretty good, but I'm wondering, do you guys have any recommendations for your favorite, like, you need this on your lips because your lips are so chapped lip balm and chapstick? Let me know in the comments. Thank you. Christmas sucks. Fa la 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 la. La 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 la. Probably, um, probably 75% of my sock drawer of ready to wear socks, not handmade socks, is Christmas socks because I just really love Christmas socks. I wear them all year round. It's kind of silly. So I'm walking into work wearing my exploration station. I just have to say, this is like the best shawl for like walking around out and about because it's the really good shape. So I highly recommend making the exploration station if you um, are looking for a really wearable shawl because it's just like a perfect shape, like I said. It's a really good size for wearing. It's very usable. and I'm headed out to, sorry, sun's like super bright. I'm heading to a place called Exy for this beet and goat cheese salad. It sounded really good. So that's what I'm getting today. Um, no word yet on Madison Square Park turning into a gingerbread house village, but fingers crossed, but I don't see it yet. So we can only hope. I lied, it's happening. I'm taking you over to see. It's in construction, it's not done yet, but just a quick update on what it looks like. So the tree is going up and there's one gingerbread house so far. Look at all the cute doggies. I love the dogs of New York City. So yeah, it's happening! So exciting! I can't wait for it to be up all the way and I'll show you guys as soon as it is! I'm guessing they're building their window display. It looks pretty cute. I love it, it smells so good. It's just like a sea of eucalyptus over there. <laughs>
called actually, Kelly. Sorry, Vlogmas. Vlogmas. And now we're going to Soul Cycle for the first time. Are you guys excited? So Woo! pumped. Yay! So pumped. So pumped. It's my first time going to Soul Cycle and I've tried almost all of them in New York City. drinks with my co-workers I just stopped in this store on the way home because they had I um, they had a bunch of like tourist merch and I've been meaning to buy an iHeart New York shirt for my nephew so I got one of those for part of his Christmas present and yeah so now I'm headed home Soul Cycle was really really hard actually like really hard I wasn't expecting it I've been doing cycling for a long time now and I love it but for some reason today, I don't know if I just wasn't feeling it or what, I don't know, but it was, it was hard. <laughs> so I need to get back into the swing of working out again. And uh, yeah, so headed home now. Talk to you guys soon. I just got home and I figured um, I would show you guys a couple of the things I got at the holiday market yesterday and then also my um, purchase tonight from the I Love New York onesie and then after that I'm probably just gonna knit and go to bed after that so this will probably be the last time I talk to you today so here goes so here's the I Love New York onesie a classic right right and then one of the things I got yesterday at the holiday market at Columbus Circle were two types of teas. This one is a passion fruit black tea and it had like sunflower and some other like oranges and other kind of notes in it. It looked really good. And then this one's going to be a gift. It's just Earl Grey and this one's going to be part of a present for a really good friend of mine. And then the second thing I got, the second thing I got is this handmade ornament. It's really heavy. It's like very good quality of Santa driving a taxi sleigh, which I just think is hilarious. So I haven't decided if I'm going to keep this for myself or give it to my nephew. Um, I can't decide if I want to give him like a more anti-specific ornament or my first Christmas ornament or if this one is good enough for him. So we'll see. And that's it for me for today. So that's a very typical day in the life of Jay Salem. So Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye! Mwah.